the last video, I got a scythe from TOB, meaning I now have max gear for each combat style. And now this is very nice because I put one boss off for a very long time, being the Nightmare. I wanted to have all my TOB tasks done before I went here, because there was a chance I would get a scythe from my CAs at TOB. And so I did. And this is going to be very helpful for my tasks. I will be going to the Nightmare and there is a couple of regular Nightmare tasks that I still have to do. Um, one of them being a five-man speed task, uh, one of them being not losing any prayer points throughout the whole kill, and then there is the solo speed as well. I also still need to do Fasani's Nightmare and now this is a very, very dangerous topic because I actually died on my last hardcore Fasani's Nightmare. So. This is definitely scary for me, and uh, that's why I've also done a plenty amount of practice on my alt, so I made sure I will not die. Luckily, we have the scythe this time around to help me out with the with the kills. I didn't have that on my previous account. For Fasani's Nightmare, I'm still missing three tasks. Speed task being a sub 730, 5 kill trip, and 25 KC. Now the real difficult one in this one is probably the speed task. Maybe the five kill trip can be a bit tricky, but with my gear that should be no problem. But Nightmare is just very dangerous itself. Now why is Fasani's Nightmare so dangerous you ask? Well, Fasani's Nightmare hits very high numbers. The max hit of the Fasani's Nightmare is actually 80 for the regular attacks and it can also max an 85 with the dash. I also have to consider that there is like minions that you have to kill and that can damage you as well. So if you mess that up, that's even more damage. That is pretty sketchy. You need to dodge special attacks as well, which can hit up to like 60, I believe. You got to be very careful. Oh, this is pretty close to GM again. I felt really close. I mean, somewhat close. Easy or in it more hunt more handle. Now we can upgrade our granite more. Upgrade, let's go. Yeah. That should be better than the claws. Okay. Time for a Fasani kill on the hardcore. It's been a while, bro. It's been a while. KC. Fasani. 12. If I get 8 more Fasani KC and 7 more Heart Mode KC, I will be ranked for every boss. My whole high score is going to be filled with KCs. That is terrible. <laughs> that is terrible. But we got a kill once again. We are doing the five kill for Sonny. Bring this. I mean, that'll work. I feel like I should wait. Even though my. So I have my divine here that's running out, but I also have my run energy that I kind of want to regen. 99. It's time to go in. It's time! Uncharge. Since I need a lot of potions for this trip, I will be uncharging my shadow to get soul runes out of it so I can actually use death charge without actually losing an inventory slot for it. I just tank that off, right? Nice. 
Good thing I killed the right frawl. I mean, uh, the right husk. Otherwise, that would have been pretty sketchy. Ah, I'm just gonna leave, bro. I, <laughs> I did not like that. Okay, it's fine. Really, a one kill anyway. Alrighty. Um, let's get back in. I don't have to wait for my energy this time because I can just eat these sweets. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I wonder if I can get the time in this setup. I highly doubt it. I mean, I probably could. Bye bye. Door stool story. I think I lost my brew, didn't I? Yeah, I did. <laughs> oh well, it's fine. <laughs> so I was juggling a brew, but... Not a kill. I missed uh, one of the sleepwalkers at the end, which is kind of uh, my hack. But as long as I got three out of four, I was fine to stay. Dude, I've not received a single supply drop in all these kills. That's so unfortunate, bro. That's so unfortunate. Not a single supply drop. I need one more kill. I thought I was gonna get hit there, I won't lie. We go! Five kill trip done! Unless I somehow miscalculated. Mm, there we go! Very nice! 18 tasks to go. You do six kills. <laughs> no. no, let's not do six kills. Where's my tablet though? Where's my tablet, bro. So, right now we have two tasks left at Fasani, I'm pretty sure. The speed and the 25 kill count. So 730 speed, 
Shouldn't be too much of an issue, I hope. And then, um, 25 KC, so six more kills to go. Hopefully I can get a speedrunner in those kills. That would be ideal. That would be ideal. Well, we'll see. I wasn't recording shit. <laughs> this is what I died for on my previous hardcore. Well, the thing is that I was higher KC than this, but the lower, the high scores, uh, KC requirements. So now I'm actually on the high scores for it. Yay! <laughs> Need to relog. Surely it doesn't, doesn't kick me out, right? Surely not. Right? Yay! All right, let's see. Why does this? Why does this robot have a? Oh, I was gonna say, bam! Oh my god! Would you look at those high scores? Only one missing. Theater of Blood hard mode, but after this update, the KC requirement goes down to fifteen. The thing is, I am thirteen. Hard mode TBKC currently. Obviously, this is gonna go up, but we would need we would need two more kills after the update to be on the high scores for every single boss. As this series is coming to an end soon, make sure you're subscribed so you're not missing out on the final episodes. We passed 5k subscribers not too long ago, so thank you all for that, and hopefully we can get to 10k soon enough. <laughs> okay! Surely that's good. Combat task completed. We got it! We want to spare! Holy that dude, that last bit was so good. <laughs> if I didn't do if I didn't do the double Gmail there. Holy that was clutch. <laughs> I just two hit it basically. Alright, four more kills and we are officially done with Fosani. That is sick. Six points, by the way, the first point task that I received. Oh, let's go, bro. I think I got another, another kill here, actually. Yeah, might as well. Bit sketchy. Yo, another kill. Collection log slot completed. Um, okay. Go on. <laughs> okay. A 22 KC nightmare stuff. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> Yo. Uh, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Uh, it's pretty sick. Okay, okay. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> we're clogging, bro. We are clogging. <laughs> um. Yo. Any back to backs? <laughs> That's uh, pretty much as good as a back to back, honestly. Honestly, we definitely take those. Holy.
Motor kill. One to go. And then we are done with Fasani. No dying at Fasani. If I live. Woo. I could I was just about just in time to kill those. Holy. Pretty bit sketchy there. There we go. The last kill at Fasani. Do we get anything? Combat task no. completed. But that is Fasani green logged. Well, the tasks are green logged, <laughs> I should say. There we go. Fasani's nightmare. It's all a green, baby. I got a random team from a Twitch chat together to attempt the no prayer task. So you're not allowed to lose any prayer points throughout the whole kill. Like anyone in the whole team. Oh yeah, this boss has chip damage. I forgot about that. Now with this task, you could literally just not pray at all and not even prayer flick like I'm doing right now and just tank the damage. It'll be fine as well, but I just rather prayer flick because I'm pretty comfortable with it and I know I won't lose a prayer point in doing it. But I think there's a couple of people in this team that are actually not praying. I think there's two of them that are not praying at all and there is three of us that are flicking. <laughs> Oh, I didn't bring a Sanfu either. Oh shit. <laughs> uh, what does the thing hit? If you don't, uh... Ah, it's fine, I just won't get targeted. Oh no! It's on me! I think I almost lost a prayer point there. Let's be careful. Oh. Shuffle. I was wondering why I was taking damage. The shuffle is annoying because you're not actively praying. So, like, you don't really realize unless you really pay attention to it. Could be one and done here. Bye, have a great time. Hey, someone just tell you now. <laughs> yeah, thank you guys. And. Combat task complete. Yeah! No one got anything, sad. <laughs> Bro, I, I barely have to scroll for all my incompleted tasks. That's crazy, dude. A sub-16 minute, so that means four divines should be enough. I mean, four sips of the vines should be enough, yeah? Shit. Um... Okay. So we bring one divine, we bring a regular super combat to boost back up if I need to brew or something. Do I even want to bring brews? I don't know, man. Um, we bring two sand fuse because probably, you know, I don't know. I have no idea. Uh, and then we bring some restores. Uh, that should be fine, I reckon. I'll do some flicking as well. Um... I need the forgotten brew. Wait, do I? Mm. So if I bring this, I guess this is for that. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Something for the husks. Oh yeah, you're right. Uh, the husks don't have a weakness, right? Like in terms of um, what you're supposed to kill them with. 
I think I can use a blade for that. I also decided to bring an amulet switch. I'm bringing both the torture and the blood fury. So I'll use the blood fury if I ever need to top off my HP. Big heal. I don't think that's anywhere close, but we'll see what the time that is. Eight? <laughs> Jesus. That is so far off. Holy. <laughs> I need to cut off basically three minutes. Like what? Not even PB, yeah. And that time is with a trident and with a... I think that's a trident at least. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's with a trident and with a bludgeon. Okay, so I started with 11k85, I do one nightmare kill, and it's down to 10,730. I use like 300 charges on one kill. Oh. <laughs> Over 300 even. Oh well. It's not, like I, it's not like I need my blood fury for anything else, apart from heart mode top, and I still have blood shards. I still have two over here, so it's fine. Like, we're more than fine, but... The sub-16 solo is by far the most difficult task at Nightmare. Including Fasani's. Okay. I missed, of course. There is a bit of RNG involved in this task if you don't have the correct gear. Now, my gear is pretty damn good, so I shouldn't have to struggle with it too much. But it's still a difficult task nonetheless. And there's still a bit, little bit of RNG involved. Hitting the hammers, for example, will make a pretty big difference. And you, as you just saw, I missed mine, so that'll be pretty bad. There are definitely things you can do to improve your time, though. And one of them uh, that is a big one is killing the parasites as soon as possible. Making sure they cannot heal the boss at all, or barely, will make a massive difference. You can run under the boss and kill the parasite from under there. You gotta be very careful though, because the shadow attack can hit you when you're underneath the boss. So you need to make sure you move away. Nice, okay. Could be worse. Um. I'm not caught it. Oh. Alright, someone has already gone wrong on this kill, but. I need to summon my damn frogs, bro. That's the wrong prayer. But I didn't get hit. I should have clawed it. I should have clawed it. I should have clawed. Bro, I'm so trolling. That was like 100 healed. <laughs> Not even close, dude, I think. No. <laughs> I mean, it's a PV. I lost, I, I definitely lost most of the time on P2, though. I, I, I lost, like, at least a minute on P2. All right, so main, main points of uh, improving is... Probably camping light bearer P2, so I can claw spec the parasite every time. And I need to move under per uh, for the parasite kill after five nightmare hits. I think that is right. And hopefully did that and some decent RNG on P1 and P3, then we should get it. I hope. As long as my claw specs actually kill the parasite, that'd be great.
Why did it heal? Huh? Did not kill it in time. I'm not camping my line bear. Fuck. Kind of troll. Alright, I'm curious what this time is. I did okay. Combat task complete. Wait. I did more than okay. What the hell? <laughs> um Okay. What? <laughs> I just got it. I didn't think that was it. I won't lie. I thought it was a a, a decent time, but I didn't think it was enough. <laughs> we got a 15 minute. 1509. Huh? <laughs> Whoa, so you need a sub 16 and I, I made minimal mistakes on this kill. I made some mistakes, but minimal. I was like, I did. I wasn't really sure if I was hitting enough. I won't lie. And, and then all of a sudden I see that I get the time. I'm like, oh, really? Also a reason why I was a bit, bit like sus on whether I would not get it is because I used three steps of the vine, which normally would equal to 15 minutes, right? But I think what I did is that I sipped the vine early one time, and therefore it, well, therefore I used three sips, <laughs> but it's not actually 15 minutes. But I was like, oh, I used three to vine, so, you know, 15 minutes. But that's sick. We're we're done with the, this is like, this is the task that Pro Switch struggled the most with, by the way. But that was mainly because of his, like, a gear at the time. And I, I have, like, extremely good gear for this, because of the scythe and the shadow. Uh, but he did it with the pre-nerfed Fang. So when TOA got released, um, the Fang was very overpowered. And it was actually better than a bludgeon here. At regular Nightmare. And even Fasani as well, I believe. So he was able to get it with the, with the pre-nerfed Fang. 14 tasks to go! 14 tasks to go. The final task for Nightmare is the 5-man speed task. Now for this, once again, I took a random team from my Twitch chat. However, I set some requirements this time as I wanted max geared mains, essentially, or Iron Man if there were any, but I think they're all mains this time. Um, just so I have the best potential for the time. On the first phase, you want to be standing on the exact same tile because the husks can come out on P1. And if you stand on the same tile, you can just kill them instantly with Din's Bulwark Specs. Flowers. It is essentially a 1 in 2 chance whether you get the flowers or whether you get the husks on the first special attack. This time we get the flowers, which is a bad thing because this means husks will come out when we are killing the pillars. And when we're on the pillars, we're no longer on the same tile. So that'll be a bit messy. That any good? I, mm, I, I don't think so. No way! Nine seconds off, yeah. Uh, I need special attack back, I guess. <laughs> yeah, P1 was pretty bad. Yeah, I mean, for a first try, bro. <laughs> we'll take it. We know we can easily get it in that case. Party blocking not work on Nightmare. <laughs> or did we actually hit three arm four hammers? <laughs> oh, mine is just broken. I don't know. 
Okay, good, good, good. Nice. That's big. Oh, it should be this one. Very nice. Hey! This is uh, very speedy. Yeah, that is it's very free, surely. That's like big time it. There we go. 316, bro. <laughs> and Sanfis. Let's go. Yo, thank you guys. Shout out to the random team that came organized from my Twitch chat. <laughs> and that is Nightmare Done. That is all of Nightmare Done. Let's have a look here. Nightmare. Both Fasani and the regular Nightmare are now green. Okay. So now officially, it's only Hydra. Two CM times, the three man and five man. And then it's hard mode. That is it. <laughs>